Hello and welcome everybody. Um, so today I'm going to be showing you one really cool site that will let you troll or prank your friends or family. Please don't cause too much harm with this. It is just to make someone smile and or laugh. So if you do enjoy this video, please hit that like button and that subscribe button. let's get into it so if we go to geekprank.com and we load it up we can see that it loads up a windows xp uh looking like machine so the thing with this site is if you press f11 it will practically look like it is on your computer you can click start and see my computer um, but what we're mostly interested in is this panel over here. So the first thing we can do is click on the hacker one. And as you can see, it gives us this kind of hacker feel. So uh, you can do a lot of things here. The best one is automate if you want to make people think you hacking something or doing something. You can press buttons and change stuff up go press f11 to get out of it but if someone doesn't know you can do a lot with this hacker one if we go back to it we can see here all of these folders you can do different things you can sit and play around with it if you want to. Just showing you a few of them. You can see we cracking parts of it here apparently. Uh, and then as you can see there are quite a few. I'm just going to run through them all and show you some other awesome features on this site. If we go to the next one, it's chat screenshot. So as you can see, you can make it whatever you want to you can change android facebook whatever you want to and you see even whatsapp and you can type a message i'm just gonna click on this demo so as you can see hey honey then hey what's up and then you can see it's making a story for us you can actually put a picture and yeah, a link to a picture or that and it will show things picture let's click ok on that I don't know what that's gonna cause an issue oh there we go you can see it adds a picture but it changed to LinkedIn if you've ever just wanted to make one of these uh, then next we can see the virus one so if you just got a few seconds you could just put this on someone's PC and then click F11 and it will look like they have a virus uh, we can also do that FBI lock so it is pretty similar it's just got an FBI feel to it next you can see this iOS prank so this basically as you can see it pranks your friends with a never ending loading screen so if someone has an apple you can probably just do this and watch them wait for it you can just do it for XP and then that just brings up this loading bar as well as Windows 7 or Windows 10 Just wait for them to load. Oh, you see. Oh, okay, we ended back up there with the Windows 10 on, I guess. Yeah, there you can see Windows 10. The next one is this pest game. So if you click prank for pests, it takes you to this site which is pestgame.com and you can edit this up and I guess if you want to 
just squish some bugs. Yeah, I was gonna say it should be making a sound. This one is so it links back to the Geekbank site because as you can see, it's got all of the same things. Because then next we can look at this fake news. So this takes us to a pretty cool sites.com from the geek prank and you can see it's news for the dumb the joke for the wise so I don't know if you want to check a story on social media you could probably come and check it over there if it is there then just know it is fake next we can look at the bias setup if you press F11 again on someone's PC they'll be able to look through the settings as soon as they exit it will just take them to this trying to boot screen and it just stays there yeah I think it might go somewhere else yeah like you see couldn't find press buttons does other stuff and we've got the pipes and all the screensaver from XP if we press there you can see it is there you can click around on it it does eventually come to the windows I mean the XP Thing where we can actually let's try and search something here oh, it just brings up a bunch of ads wow this is actually the same site that we're on geek pranks and see we can play tetris at least they're keeping tetris alive and then some awesome songs apparently we can't hear right now if you go here you will be able to hear them you can also see that we've got some mind sweepers if we click start we can go through these now now let's finish with this list first uh, next we have the matrix rain code so this just brings up green code quite quite awesomely if you want to just keep the monitor busy I guess you can put this on instead of watching uh, video I guess this just runs then we just got TV noise it just brings up static TV old ass TV Cracked screen, cracked screen is a really awesome one to prank your friends if they like. If you got their laptop or something, you put cracked screen on and then you're like, oh, like you don't actually drop it, but pretend to drop it and then they'll be really upset with you, I'm sure. So you've got the static. And we've got the last one, which is this Jurassic Park thing. You can play around with it. I wasn't really that interested in it. And as you can see, it's like that other one. Um, click start. Let's go here. Or if you click start and click on something. Boom. System malfunction. So, thank you, everybody. If you did enjoy this video, please hit that like button and that subscribe button.